Merrill Kelly just moments ago, scratched from the start tonight. He has been placed on the injured uh, list with a right nerve shoulder impingement. Riley Smith recalled, and Taylor Clark will make the start at the last second here. Left hand hitting Rymel Tapia to lead it off against the right-hander Clark. And he's going to get it out here on a ground ball from Walker to Clark, covering one away. Here's Trevor Story, the shortstop, who leads Colorado with eight home runs. 69 career games against the D-backs. He's hit 327, 19 overs, 50 RBIs. Dangerous, dangerous hitter. Breaking ball hit well to left field. Going back Peralta, and it is long gone. Touch him all time for Trevor's story. He loves hitting at Chase Field. The Rockies take a one to nothing lead. Yeah, Trev, that went a long yeah, way. Yeah. <laughs> and here's Nolan Arenado. And Nolan, a sharp base hit to left. Isn't that a good sign? So he's five for his last five after getting a, a day off. Here's Murphy, the first baseman. There's a ground ball to first. Walker's got it. He'll throw to second for one and then back to Clark covering at first. Now Ryan Castellani. I wonder if the nerves are the same that you'd expect if this was a crowd full of people and many of whom he would know, including uh, his family. Probably not quite as high a level of nerves, but it's still got to be there. This is in the air to Hilliard in right, taking the place of Blackman, and he makes the catch. Here's Cattell Marte hitting 336. And this ball's lifted toward Hampson in center. And twice with his fastball, he beat Calhoun, and he beat Marte enough Good. that he stayed off the barrel. Good sign, too. Ground ball bobbled by Murphy, recovers, flips it to Castellani, and Starling Marte is out number three, a 10-pitch, 1-2-3 start for Ryan Castellani. One out walk and the Diamondbacks get the tie run on base for Escobar. Drip back up the middle, on into center field for a base hit. Walker is going to go to third and they'll throw over there on the run. Back to second, out at second base. That's all Nolan. He knew he didn't really have a play on Walker. He went and met the baseball and fired to second. Tremendous play by the Gold Glover. Now it's going to take something from Nick Ahmed with two outs to get a run in. Ground ball left side, backhanded by Trevor Story across the diamond, dug out by Daniel Murphy at first, and Arizona strands a man at third. A lead single, and the lineup flips over to Rymel Tapia. And Tapia with a soft liner that gets a pass Marte. And Tony with a good read head towards third. He's in trouble there. Ball gets Safe. out. And Tony will stay at third and moving up is Tapia. I mean, Tony Walters did the full Pete Rose there, head first into third base, but angled a bit toward the defender there. Made it look like he was diving for the bag, but it more looked more like a dive for the glove. And now they will walk Arnado intentionally. So the bases are loaded for Murphy. This ball is well hit to right center field. Calhoun makes the catch. Walter scores. And the Rockies have a 2-0 lead. Calhoun lined out to right field his first time up. It looked like he might have had one head to the seats. Calhoun swings, hits a fly ball to deep right field. Back of the warning track, back of the wall. Touch them all, Paul Calhoun. As that one's way, way out of here. The Diamondbacks are on the board. It's 2-1. Here's Christian Walker. Over the last five, the Diamondbacks are slugging 236. Walker hits it high down the line. Will it stay fair? Christian Walker, say goodbye. We are tied at two. Well, they hit one home run in five games on the road. Here they've hit two in two innings. Walters into second base with a double. Now Tappy at the plate. Bouncing ball to the right side. Grab. No, it got through and into right field. And Tony Walters is going to score. It looked like Marte was going to get to that ball, but he didn't. 3 2 Rockies back into the lead. Calhoun, the base runner. And Cattell has fly to center and walked against Castellani. That's a home run in a silo. <laughs> Will it drop in? Nope, Topping is there. And Calhoun back at the bag at first, out number two. Now it kicks away from Murphy. Cole going to go to second. Now they got him hung up. Walters was backing up the play and did a tremendous <laughs> job, and they dropped the ball. Oh, they say he moved into it potentially or caught him okay. out. Torrey's hot. He is really hot with the first base umpire, and Torrey's not long for this game. He's gone. He's just been tossed. From Rob Drake's angle, it does look like Cole Calhoun yeah. kind of leaned his head into it like a soccer play. And I'm still madly in love 
with Cole Calhoun for doing that in the first place. <laughs> Castellani's still out there for a six on the board, which would be a high for him. Swing and a miss. He got him with a breaking ball. Good inning for Ryan Castellani. Now first and third for Murphy. This becomes a very important out for the Diamondbacks here on this ball game. Yeah, this is a big one here. Got him. Went to that slider. Kevin Ginkle gets himself in a jam and gets himself out of it. They get bad in the ball game right here. Down one, two, one, and two out. Calhoun, he homered in the third. Uh, this is a high fly ball to deep left. And Tapia will make the catch. Woo! <laughs> Breathe <laughs> okay. again. Well, we go bottom of the ninth inning. 3-2 Rockies. They bring on right-hander Daniel Barr. One out, and here is Nick Ahmed. That's a foul ball off the of Tony. <laughs> Tony is hobbling, and now he's gone down. With that hit, it is still painful. They're going to take him out of the game, and Drew Butera will replace him. The Rockies are an out away from snapping a seven-game losing streak. He's got him. They'll finish the play at first, and the Rockies win it 3-2. to two. The seven-game losing streak is gone.